Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining me. This is GGF bringing you episodes 16 slash 11 of Let's Try Runes and Riches slash Adventures of a Calabeth. We're going to get right into this, guys. Loading up. I am so sorry. Give me a second here to fix this. All right, we're back. Let's go ahead and give this a try. Hope you guys are doing well and ready to check out some more adventures of Macalabeth with me. We are having a blast. Um, we're now in the city of Britain, I think, the capital. And this has been quite enlightening. Um, we're in here with Todd, the herbalist. Let's go ahead and see if we can sell anything to him. Nothing. Um, well, that's a nicer... Uh, it's a nice bill of sale, isn't it? Indeed. Could buy a mortar and pestle. Um, we have some stuff to do, but anyway. Hope you guys are well. We're going to have him check out this unusual jar of reagents. Because if I taste them with my low tasting skill, I'll end up throwing them out. For 20 gold, we can have him check them. So you seem to have 27 black sand. You don't want the black sand, he won't buy it. Curious bottle of liquid that goes to someone else. Peculiar jar, I have 29 of whatever this is. We'll hire him again. Seems to be 29 ginseng. He'll buy the ginseng at two a pop. Yeah, that's 58 gold, son. We'll take that. Boom. Very good. And let's see, do we have any other else re any other reagents to sell? We have a superb painting of Nace of the Marquise. We have 530 feathers. 10 ball of yarn. Curious bottle of liquid. Uh, maybe we can arms lure that one? No, that's not going to work on liquid. Can we mercantile it? You need tasting on that, okay. We do have this agapite bracelet, which is cool. Two bat wings. Um, and we also have this item that we stashed over here. A curious item. Looks like some sort of helmet. Weight six stones. Blacksmith, weaponsmith, or armor can identify. Use arms lore to determine what it is. We're going to do that right now. It is... You can't seem to identify it. Interesting. Can we only use arms lore once on it? Can we try again? Can't seem to identify it. We're going up in skill, though. We successfully identify it. It is an exceptional dull copper dread helm. Requires 64 strength, 170% durability. Dog, 11% physical resist and 20% lower requirements. That's awesome, but 64 health or 64 strength. That is going to be a minute because if we look at our info bar, for example, let's actually go to the info bar. Can we add another item and have it be like our strength and stuff? Stats cap. There's some cool stuff here. Different damage chance, different resists, luck, no strength or anything though. What is luck? Should we have luck up there as a bit of green? I can't see green. Is it like there? I guess that's good enough. We put luck at the end. Our luck is zero. Is it worth keeping up there? I guess so. So um, we'll just hit okay on that. All right, what else did we find? We have, let's see. We're gonna wanna tinker. We have 27 black sand. Put that in the bag here. An evil omen, the bone gloves. Um, a knife, let's put the knife in the bag. The uh, exceptional, probably gonna sell that as good as it is. Probably make a nice bundle off that. 
And uh, yeah, let's roll. Uh, you don't want to buy anything more, right? Let's head out. We've got a baker down here. Um, we sold all the food that we could. Here we have a Britain healers. So we're in the capital Britain. Beasts of burden. A uh, yeah, um, taming place. I mean, there's so many skills I want to do, and, you know, my buddy Christian made a good point that I should have alts and stuff doing a lot of that. Strength and steel. Let's just see if we can sell anything. They will buy the axe for 20. I need the axe. And I guess he's the only person in here. There's a rat. Um... can come here though and there's Boyce who happens to be the guild master hey we can sell you the dread helm for 424 um it's gonna be forever till we get to, to 64 strength where is um is it status No, status shows the same thing. Oh, it does show our stats, though. Ah. Huh. Why would I put that on there just like that? times I guess all right but we have a 38 do I want to pick up a quick 500 for it um it's exceptional but it is dull copper 424 yeah I think we'll go ahead and pass it on we also have other stuff That was a pretty nice find and all. I think we'll find more like it. It's not going to be that big of a deal in the in the long run. Getting rid of that. By the time we reach that uh, 64 strength, we'll be able to use you know something greater. There's the monk. Wonder who I sell the painting to. Some sort of art dealer. Map maker, cartographer, maybe this sort of thing. Cartographer's guild. Oh, you're the uh, guild master. Mariner's guild, no. Taylor's guild. You won't buy the dark yarn or whatever it is. You should buy the water skins. For the Taylor's Guild, really? Oh, there's another one up there. Bark of the Cobbler. Nothing. Oh, maybe the jewelry store here. Is this the jewelry store? No, this is the Bard's Guild. Nothing. This is. Log goods. So this is wooden stuff. I don't think we have anything to sell at the wood shop. Carpenter's Guild. But there is a saw table there. We can make boards if we want. Let's continue exploring. The Lord's Clothier. Clothiers, yep. Oh, we can sell the royal shirt. Beautiful. For 10 GP. Sell it. And we can sell the ball of yarn. We have 10 of them. 10 balls of yarn and 8 apiece. Nasty. 80 gold. There is a spinning wheel. We 
could have spun it up ourselves, but I don't think we're going to be doing tailoring anytime soon. Even though I would want to. Premier Gems. This should be interesting. Merchant's Guild. The Agapite Bracelet. 334. Yes. Sell that. Boom. Beautiful. Thank you, Bertram. We are making crazy loot, son. Profuse provisions. Hey! Candle, lantern. Um, let's see if that lantern still lights up. Of course, we have to take the sword off. No, that lantern is out of fuel, and I don't know how to relight it, so. Plus, you have to take it off, so let's hey. just sell the lantern for a gold piece. We're carrying a lot of gold right now. Grand Clockmakers Tinkers. Looks like there's the Guildmaster for tinkering. Um, that's a barrel. <laughs> Eric can't trade uh, trade anything. Huh, do I want to join the Tinker's Guild? Probably not. Unicorn's Horn. It is a double clicker. Just a place like this. Panthea the Waiter. What can we buy from her? Hey. Bottle of wine. Okay, some rations. Rico the Verbose. Trash barrel, tarot cards. I think Rico stole it while we were distracted. Narrow the Pyrus. Pyrus. Why did the king go to the dentist to get his teeth crowned? Oh, <laughs> Bertram, another Bertram. Um, I forget what psychology hey. does. Circus tent, backpack, torch, the art of thievery, a wooden box, hair dye, disguise kit. Um, let's see, someone passed out. An adventurer. Demon dartboard, um, chessboard, the merchant advertiser, um, if we go up, Darnell the Steady, Peyton the Gibbous, Jarvinia, we can sell wheels of cheese. Uh, 12 GP is a pretty good. We'll sell one of them for 12 GP. It's a pretty good buy. Um, Keisha. Someone from Grey died in the desert searching for Narnaima's key of the defender. Hayo never returned while trying to locate Mangar the Dark. Ragnar of the sea. Someone from Springvale died in the stronghold of the haunted, searching for the mystical veil. Not much to do in here, it seems. Aha. I lost that weapon in the flooded temple. Cleaver, which is food. Nothing we can sell. Come down this way. We've got a gypsy. A board. 
Mark Sidra? Sidra the Ninth? What is this? Can't get in? Oh, it's entrance right here. Oh. Robin was in the tavern talking about Karen's elixir of the sky and the tunnels. Word? Huh. Alright. I think we've gone and explored most of Britain. What was that down there? The, uh, oh, the bank. Maybe we sell the painting to the bank. Let's try that. Men of the Minter. Superb painting. Oh, he does not buy it, huh? We sell that to 27 Black Sand, Evil Omen. Curious Bottle of Liquid. We didn't get that identified yet. Let's rejuvenate potion. Nine Cooked Bird. Bone Gloves. Just put them in here with our further gear up here. A pumpkin. Is good eats. Silver. <laughs> I thought we had some silver in here. Refried eggs. Good eats. Tinker's tools. 40 ingots, we'll get to that. strength 55 the bone arms all right that's good donation box statue board status board there's no one over here that we give the painting to right Taking brave sailors sage of ice local guilds of the Merchant's Guild. Oh, we can sell to these peeps too. They're Merchant's Guild. Always worth seeing if there's anything we can sell. Hmm. So it's not the bank. There's the wood shop. We have some fur. Here is the bard's tail. Wow. Oh, we were in there, okay. The best hides. They might buy the fur. Taylor's Guild. They'll buy the water skins. Cobbler will not buy the fur. Oh, I didn't see you down here, Marcia. You won't buy anything. Oaken ore. I don't think they'll buy fur. Sorry for any background noise, guys. I don't think the monk is gonna buy fur. Let's 
Let me maybe go ask what we do with the painting. Um, first, let's try to sell the Warriors Guild. X. Um, okay. make 80 gold off the ingots, but might as well keep them to craft with. Defenders of Cesaria, there's not really a traitor in here amongst them. Oh, there's Warrior's Guild, but he's the guild mistress, or she's the guild mistress. And these are just peeps in the guild. Have the monk, pack horse, good eats, no pointy arrow. Ah, the magic garden. This should be interesting. It is the oh, yeah, the alchemist guild. No, they don't want anything. No magic shop, from what I can see. Britain Herders. Do you guys maybe want fur? That's the guild master. Beast of Burden. Wow, two. A Druid's Guild and a Herders. Two dedicated to taming. Here, a horse. Huh. Try good eats again just to see if they change their mind on any on buying anything. Skillet cooked bird. All right, we'll sell. Oh, cooked birds for eight GP. We'll sell five of them for forty. They're pretty good to keep, of course. Um, that's a good deal. Water barrels. Let's go ahead and fill her up. And come down this way. Map maker, cartographer, uh, fisherman. Alright, so no one here to sell the painting to. At least not yet. That's uh, the best heights of Britain. Right, we tried to sell here. Nobody seems to want it. Did I try you? Hey. I did. Oh yeah, water skins. I keep forgetting Parker the cobbler doesn't want it. Basement trap door. Upright loom, spinning wheel. Being the mighty is just down here working. Okay, now we can use that door. We use this door. Oh, it's warped. Probably the same as this door. Bias of the brown. We can't really come up here. Oh, here we can. Where should the fur trader? You should have fur. You should want my fur. Maybe tomorrow or something she will. Hero the carpenter. Just make sure nothing wanted here by Euro. Oh wait, can we uh a lumber axe? We're working tools. Boards. 
and logs. Okay, a uh, hammer. Let's go ahead and grab a lumber axe for 27. And go ahead and sell um, that axe back to the to the warriors. Everyone listen, Garrett the Gibbous stole the angelic dagger of Genfien, the sorcerer, sorceress. Bank of Britain. Where is... Whoa. Great clockmakers. Let's check the basement trap door here. Tobias and the Brown Order, these are just people working. And here we have a an anvil, a forge. In case we need it. I guess we could activate this door too, huh? Let's you go through for good, probably. How do I get out of here, though? That's out. Okay. Alright, so I think it's time to head out on an adventure. Wow, we're pretty heavy, though. The ingots and stuff. Let's see what we can craft. With the tinker's tools. Different tools. Um, hatchet. Four ingots. The item retains the color. Sure, let's try to make a hatchet. Failed to create it. Let's try again. Failed to create it. Wow, we're using all our ingots. <laughs> we're gonna use all our ingots on a single hatchet. Oh, it's 0.8%. Oops. Scribe's pen, scissors, pickaxe, or spade, mortar, best cement maker's pen. Watch for a lock pick. One ingot, 0% chance. Um. Tinker's tools, tongs, trapping tools, which is cauldron, sledgehammer, woodworking tools, miscellaneous. Wind chimes? No chance, bro. Can I make a key ring? Yeah. Made a key ring. There it is. Let's see if we can sell that. Wizards, Stav, Scepter, and Wizard Staff. Wow. Takes Majory and Ingots. Wooden items, uh, miscellaneous. Jewelry. Um, we have iron, so maybe, no. Uh, assemblies, uh, Ocean key? Uh, it's a lot of stuff. Ten percent chance to make the butcher knife. Spoon. Created an item. Our skill goes up. Created an item. All right, let's just exit for now. There's the, sp the 
spoon. And key ring. And we still did identify the curious bottle of liquid. Um my tasting is too low to do it. Where can we get that identified at? Um, there's no scribe here, it looks like. That would be scrolls anyway, but... I guess pay 200 gold to have like a blacksmith identified or something. Repair that. Oh, he wants to repair it. Um, who identifies the potion? I wonder. What is? What is? What can we hire the culinary guild for? Can't hire them actually. Magic Garden. Oh, they have to be able to identify it. Does it need my services? I could train tasting. He wants 271 for it. And we're at 260. Yeah, why not? go with oh, 271. How about 260? Ready? Boom. Tasting 26.5. Let's go ahead and taste it. Pick up. Identify the liquid spasming and spilling. Oh, you fail inside the bottle. So, it just, we failed and it's gone now, so. That's enough of that. Looks like it gave us two hit points, no? Um. Hey! But at least we have a little bit of tasting now. We can identify stuff. Mushroom, cactus, flowers. Mortar and Pestle. Let's buy a Mortar and Pestle. Mixtures. Liquid Fire. Oh, it tells you what's needed. Elixirs. Oh, Elixirs to increase, like, stats. Potions. Wow. Can I make a lesser heal? It takes 50. Oh no. Ginseng and open bottle. Wow, no kidding. Empty bottles. Can I tinker up empty bottles? That'd be interesting. Doesn't look like it though. Um, well, like we have ginseng, we can make some heal potions. Get some alchemy going. My skills don't seem to have a lot of hair. Oh, hair dye potion. My skills don't have a lot of synergy. I'm not really synergizing too well. by 55 alchemy. I don't know if I want to get into alchemy. We gotta pick like a good one and stick with it. Blood moss and empty bottle makes uh, an agility potion. Conflagration. It takes 55 alchemy and 5 grave dust. 
Uh, I mean, yeah, we could potentially make heal potions, but three ginseng in one empty bottle makes a regular heal potion rather than a lesser. I don't know. We'll have to think about it. Can I buy bottles from you? Probably. Hey. No. We should just think. We're we're at the tinkering capital here. There's a guild master of tinkering, so we might as well just stick to them. You might buy the buy the. Uh, oh, you're the master healer. You might buy some of those ingredients, no? Yeah, we need a bit more synergy hey. rather than all these one-off skills. Manage a 2 GP, one stone. Five bandages. Carry four bandages. Oh, there's another spoon. <laughs> Dealing with minuscule items. Pretty cool, though. And this again is our neophyte chef. It's the Druid's Guild. Animal Tamers. Yeah, so I think this episode is probably... Oh, we have a few minutes left. We can get into a couple fights, I guess, maybe? Wow, fire elemental. Huh, exit this way. Let's see what can we get into a fight with. With our new sword. Oh, that's right, we're using a new sword. Trying to come up here. Let's try fighting an eagle with our new sword. As I light a smoke here, guys, let's try it. Ooh. Yeah, probably not gonna go our favor. Mmm. <laughs> One smash hit is really all it takes. 36 more feathers. A few more eggs. A raw bird. Yeah, I mean, it takes just a smash. Oh, watermelons, corn. can eat corn by itself, right? Yeah, but you can eat the corn by itself. There's wheat. Oh, what did I put in my backpack? Head of cabbage will eat that. Watermelon. Lettuce. Cabbage. We'll just take the corn. doesn't seem to be a big seller usually and we'll take the watermelons too are they one stone oh they're five stone a piece yikes we'll try to sell them cows uh probably a billet here oh right and there's peeps out here that could buy our stuff too like here we have the culinary guild another culinary guild lots of culinary guild And we should probably go the way of the Tinker because there's just, we're in the perfect spot to do so. I want to come to this farm though. Hawk. All it takes is one shot. Sword is very slow. It's going to take about two shots. 
Wow, we're getting rocked too. Oh, here's the other uh tomatoes. Cabbage. We could cook. I mean we are cook. I'll grab the tomatoes. They're probably one stone. And I want to thank you guys for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I appreciate you all very much. In the event that you'd like to help my channel, and if you enjoyed this episode, please consider dropping a like, giving the thumbs up. Leave a comment, let me know what you think. Subscribe if you're new here, and hit the notification icon. But only do those things if you really want to. No pressure or anything like that. I don't want to pressure you guys in any way, so it's all good, whatever you choose to do. Um, until next time, guys, uh, I hope you'll join me next time. There's much more fun to be had. Sell a couple pumpkins for eight gold. Awesome. So this is the place to be for culinary, too, it looks like. Um, but I hope to see you guys next time. Like I said, much more fun to be had. We're going to be doing all sorts of fun stuff around Britain and the outlying lands. So hope you'll join me. Um dead horse look at this oh my gosh there's a ton of stuff here 55 copper 13 silver 33 gold nuggets son let's take this fur and put this fur down and feathers 43 feathers and then there's a dead pack horse nice way to end the episode 18 red lotus 117 silver. Skull with candle, five stones. A peculiar item. Ooh, arms lore. Save that for next time. Amber ring, sellable. Tourmaline, sellable. Strange bottle of liquid. Greater mana potion, sellable. And 425 copper. And five lock picks. Not bad. We decide we want to go into lock picking. There's a torch and a strange bottle of liquid. 18 red lotus. Ah, we'll take it. It's cheap enough, but yeah, we can't move now. Um, I want to put something down. One watermelon, uh, and then two more watermelons. So we have a dead adventurer. I've elected the traveler. She's got the myth of the bow of Shoth. <gasps> That's a quest item book. Boom. We can find a rare bow, maybe. She's got an unusual wand etched with unknown dwarven symbols. She's got 99 silver. She's got 29, 28 shadow iron ingots, 65 copper. Uh, refresh potion, curious jar of reagents. Is that a hawk? Okay, a raven. Uh, lesser heal potion, that's good to have. Um. 28 shadow iron. We'll grab those. Gotta be worth money, right? And we'll throw down two more watermelons. And we'll fight this. That was a pretty good find, to say the least. But, yeah, as I was saying, guys. Um, be well, live well, stay well. As you can see, we are having some fun. We've got to train. Oh, I have swordsmanship. As... Yeah, that's pretty bad. All this swordsmanship we're doing, and I have it locked. <laughs> Let's pick it up here. Um, but yeah, guys. We're going to have some fun with this one. I mean, I can see this easily going. Well, maybe not easily, but I can see it going 100 episodes, guys. That's how crazy this game is. But uh, episode 12 will be next, and I hope to see you then. Much love, peace, and joy, guys. Love you guys. Oh, I better get back to town. Because I can actually be... Uh...
hills out here in the wilds. I'm not camping or anything. Swordsmanship is going up. I don't think it's a good idea to uh, leave out in the countryside like that. At least our swordsmanship is going up. Fighting a dove. Can't seem to take out the dove. <laughs> Did give us 25 feathers and another raw bird. Cool. Alright, so we'll just head back to town here. If a bird gets in our way, then it's gonna have a bad day. That's what I always say. I can't wait to play more because this game is not a bore or a chore. <laughs> Good stuff in store, so I hope you'll join me for that. Rhyming ridiculously. Okay. Let's get it here. P status. Alright, and that's P status for me as well. See you guys next time. Bye bye.